future is now because on today's show is all about the new toys. What will be the next best toy? Well, this place is where we'll see it next. Welcome to London Toy Fair 2020. <laughs> For all you Batman fans out there, here is the original Batmobile from the Batman movies. So we brought the Batmobile in yesterday, but it was pretty cool. Uh, it came on a big lorry and they popped it onto the ground and they started it up and everyone in Toy Fair came running to see what was happening. So Simone, is it really bulletproof? It is bulletproof. So this is the tumbler that was used in the Dark Knight and the Dark Knight Rises movie. So you can imagine that Christian Bale was inside and driving, the, uh, driving it down Gotham City and just being really, really cool. Bo, do you like action figures? Yeah. So we have Batman collections. So 12 inch figures, those are your classic big action figures that you've seen before. The new four inch figures as well. So they're little guys that come with accessories inside. We've got a bat cycle and two figures so you can ride around in your really cool bat cycle. And then you get all the way to the bottom, it's a bat boat. So pop the bat boat into the back of the Batmobile and it's a really cool item that you can use to drive around and put your action figures inside. Do you want to have a play? Yeah. Do you want to give it a go? Yeah. Right, so the idea is this. 15 questions and on the roll of just one coin, you can change everything. Which one of these chocolate bars contains peanuts? Is it picnic, double decker or lion? Double decker. No, it was picnic. So then I will pass on to the next person, right? So whoever after 15 questions gets the most money, they play the final round. And each of these lanes turn into win, lose, win, lose. So if you've got maybe 63,000 pounds, get it in the win lane, you take the money. To launch the coin, just press this button and keep your finger on it. Remember, win, lose, win, lose, win, lose. Good luck. He's gone for it. 25 grand! Yeah. Good work. Nice. Nice to meet you, mate. Good to see you, good luck. Yeah. Were you gonna fist bump me? Yeah. Why not? So this is coming soon, right? This is amazing. Good luck. All you need to do is blow the pipe. All right, get it back in. Do you think you can do it? I think. Let's make sure this is clean. Ready to go? So all you gotta do is get the ball in there, give it a really good blow. Oh my god! <laughs> How did you do that? So we're here at John Adams for Rubik's Cube's 40th anniversary and we've got some professional beef cubers and they're going to show us how fast they can race. I think I'm going to have a go. Are you ready guys? Three, two, one. Yeah, I don't, I, I won. <laughs> and to celebrate the 40th anniversary of Rubik Cube's international launch, John Adams have brought out an exciting bunch of new Rubik's puzzles to keep you thinking. 
Which brings me to my very own Tip Top Toy Award for 2020. My award this year goes to the Kiddie Zoom Studio Camera made by VTech. I think kids like me would love this, so let's check it out. So we're here at the VTech stand with Charlotte and I have my own Kid Zoom camera but VTech have gone one step further and made the Kid Zoom studio. So Charlotte here is going to tell us more about it. Thanks. So it has a, a tripod that you can attach to it and remove. And it has a camera and it's also a video camera. And then you can flip it up if you want to take selfies. Uh, it has a video recorder, uh, it has various games. It has the green screen, which I'll show you in a moment. But then when you've made your videos, you can then go onto the editing, uh, video editor and you could do time-lapse videos. You can cut and paste them and do them in different ways. We've also got the trick video maker. So you can have, say, something where you're wearing one outfit and then suddenly you click your fingers and then you change into a different outfit. But the thing I think that you like the best is it has um, a green screen capability. So it comes with a green screen and then when you hold it up, you can be floating in the sea with a shark, I'm dying. swimming, uh, and then you can you can create your own. Pass it over to you, and then if you get a green screen behind me, then you can see me. Do I disappear? There you go. And then put it right so there. So, how much would these be in the shops? Uh, the retail price is fifty nine ninety nine. And when will they be in the shops? Uh, they should be out for July, so just in time for the summer. Twerking llamas and flossing sloths. Whatever will they think of next? Yes, I'm introducing you to the uh, twerking llama. So as you can see, she's got a very nice bum action. Yes, yeah, so we're bringing her out in this rainbow version this time. So yeah, that's uh, yeah three different dances on that one. What do you think of that one, though? Interesting. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. What will they think it's of it's next? Very crazy. It is a bit crazy. He seems to be zooped up this time. The white one wasn't quite so fast, but yeah, I think they've given this one a bit of butt action. Yeah. Okay. And then over here we have got. This is the new one that's out this year. This is Fifi, the flossing sloth. Ah, here we go. Can you floss? Yep. Yeah. She gets faster. So I have to turn this around a little bit because she doesn't move, but you can see her little bum shaking here. Do you want to do a little bit of uh, flossing with her? Yes. Good action. I'm loving the flossing. <laughs> I won. She's just like, I'm, I, I, I lost. Sad days. I'm here at Moose and oh my gift, I've just bumped in to Peter Jenkins. Hello, Bo, how are you? Good, mate. Oh, these are absolutely, I've been here for quite a few hours now and these are inspired by 50 of the most popular gifts online Gift. and they're like interactive collectibles so you know how the last few years collectibles have been big news yes like lol yeah big news so collectibles it feels like oh my gift is where collectibles to have started to well come to life a little bit yeah because yeah. they're like animated but they're really like collectibles but more grown up because they yeah. uh, they give you something back but not only are there all of these different i mean i keep doing that one because it's my favorite this one Sausage slam. Yeah, funny, isn't it? How funny? On a scale of not to very. <laughs> that funny. So, so inside the packs as well, you get a collectible card, yeah. uh, which is augmented reality. So you scan over it with the dedicated app, and that brings your characters to life, so you can collect them physically and digitally. I'm blown away. Which one? Have you got a favourite? Um, where was it? Oh, yeah, here. Oh, nice. What does that do? I can think, oh yeah, deal with it. Ah, nice. The, and then he get he gets this, he gets the cool glass. I think we should just prod it, prod it for you and see what they do. Yeah, yeah. Prod that. Look at that one. 
So we're here at the Bandai stand looking at the Dragon Ball figures. Um, apparently they're really big at the moment and Megs, tell us more about it. Yes, so Dragon Ball is massive. Uh, it's actually the number one anime in the world. So we've got a really, really big range of action figures and they are really highly articulated. So you can actually pose them in over 9,000 positions. It's really cool and it's all the key characters from the TV show which is airing on pop. Um, so it's really all about boys and fighting, martial arts. So it's really, really cool. So we can actually grab the figures and have a little fight if you want. So this is Goku, he's the main hero of the TV series and that's Broly, like one of the big baddies. He's like really muscly and like really strong. You were tall, I looked up From where I sat, wished I wouldn't dressed up Your first line, won't forget So is it true, no one's taking you yet I remember people, staring as we stepped outside They had only one goal, give me all for your mind I was no good, they said, you could do much better as you can see, we're at the Jazzwear stand and I've just bumped in to some Squishables. These are one of my favourite cuddly teddies, really. And as you can see, this is my favourite one, the duck. But there's brand new ones like a walrus, koala, a dragon. But I like the duck. Also out in the next couple of months is Roblox characters. These are $9.99 in the shops. And as you can see, they're very cool. This is my favourite one, the new attack one, because as you can see closely, in the robot is a little new, and he gets these accessories like a gun and this little new sign, and then like you can point it at your friends, telling that they're noobs. It's really funny. guys that's it for another year toy fair 2020 is now ended goodbye all the toys i will see you next year 2021 bye